Hi, I'm Steve Fisher. Have you ever thought about adding electronics to your acoustic drum set? Well, that's called a hybrid set. And you can get really creative when you do that. Adding electronics to your acoustic drum set is nothing different than if you buy an effect cymbal or an extra cowbell to add to your acoustic set. You're getting more sounds, and it can make you play a little differently, but you're being more creative with more sounds. The great thing with adding electronics is the sound choices are endless. Not only just individual sounds, but triggering loops, or unique sounds, or layering sounds. I mean, melodic sounds, it virtually is endless what you can do. Just to give you an idea for acoustic drum triggering, what we have here, I've got my beautiful DW set, and that's why we're talking about acoustic drums here and using my DW set. I'm going to turn the volume down on my SPD-30. So the only thing you're hearing is the acoustic kick and the acoustic snare. Now if I turn up the volume, you actually hear the difference. And of course, the triggers trigger perfectly. practice everything that I'm doing. Now, in essence, for those of you that are curious how this works, it's pretty simple. What I'm actually doing is turning my acoustic drums into an electronic drum pad. Because when I strike the drum, the energy from the drum goes to the trigger, and then the trigger sends a signal to the module and triggers the sound. So it's pretty simple. But it can be very complex if you don't know what you're doing and you're not using the right equipment. So that's why the Roland stuff works so great, and that's why the pros use it. Do you have an idea of some of the options I have that I can do with triggering my acoustic drums for making a hybrid set? Let me play a couple of different sounds in here. First of all, you can add any sound you want to. For example, let's say the bass drum, I can have the snare drum. I can have a fight bell. And since the RT-10S is dual trigger, I have head and rim. Now I've got the bar trigger pad here, and you want to know something? You haven't heard the bar trigger simply because it's not going to get any vibrations because it has complete isolation from the drum, even though we've attached the BT-1 to the acoustic drum, I'm not going to get any crosstalk, which is the beautiful thing using Roland's advanced triggering technology. So I've got my bar trigger pad here and the dual trigger snare. Take a listen. I've got three very distinct and very different sounds, but you don't hear any crosstalk. Get the idea. So right there, I've got some really cool sounds there that I can utilize. So again, you can see how I can trigger any sound I want to. Let's go back to just the, the full drum kit. Um, the great thing also about the SPD-30, besides the four dual trigger inputs, it has a hi-hat input. So I've got my FD-8 plugged in. So I actually said for my BT-1 to be the hi-hat pad. So I can play, uh, this is a great little full drum set that I've got just right here. Take a listen. get the idea. It's really cool to be able to play all those sounds. Now, the fun thing about triggering my acoustic drums and with a hybrid set is it allows you to play different sounds. So if you're going to play different styles, you've got the sounds there to complement with your acoustic drum set. For example, let's say I want to play a ballad. Well, instead of a lot of outboard gear, as far as having lots of reverbs and stuff like that, I've got effects built into the SPD-30, and there's the same thing with all our modules. They have built-in digital effects. So if I want to play a ballad, a big ballad, and get a big snare drum sound and reverb on the tambourine, I've got it right here. That's cool. Let's say I want to do something more dance-oriented. Well, I've got my TR-909 sounds here, so I can actually trigger my TR-909 bass drum and also the TR-909 snare drum, and I've got all those sounds there, those complementary sounds, to play dance music. Again, you have lots of fun doing sounds like that. So whatever sound you pick, you can play along with it. Again, it changes the whole atmosphere and the whole vibe of your acoustic drum set by doing something like this. What I'm going to also do is actually play along with the loop, because the SPD-30 has what's called a phrase loop. 
And you can make up your own phrase loops in here and create your own loops and have a lot of fun doing it. Let's take a listen. Now the great thing about the BT-1 is it's not only perfect for adding additional sounds, but like I did in that last example, I used it for a function which is starting and stopping loops. And you can also use it for patch up, patch down, or turning effects on and off. So the BT-1 is a perfect product for adding to your acoustic drum set to make your hybrid drum set. As is all the other Roland V-Drum products. Because if you want the best results, you need to have the best tools. So adding electronics to your acoustic drum set is really great because it's opening up a whole new world of sonic possibilities that you can be creative with. And the great thing is, as you saw earlier, there's so many different options that you can actually make that hybrid set uniquely yours and have your own unique sound.